We're down at the uh, St. Paul uh, Ice Fishing Show. I'm talking to a friend of mine, Bro Brosdorf from Minnesota. And Bro, you know, one of the things you're famous for is a panfish. And guys want to get out there. What's the first great tip you can give them on catching panfish through the ice? Well, the one thing to remember, panfish are always trying to stay away from predators. You know, from the time that they're a minnow to the time that they're big platter-sized crappie or bluegill or beautiful perch, they're hiding. So the first place to look is in green vegetation. If there's a big weed line or weed bed, start at the edge of that, and sometimes they're inside of it. But remember, some lakes have different characteristics, and if the food isn't there, if the weeds are dead, they're going to dump it to the basin. So my tip is here. Always look to the weeds, and if you don't find the fish, then go to the basin. And where do you fish in a basin? If you have a big flat lake or a lake with a lot of structure, just remember, the part that faces the weed bed in the summertime that, that's nearest the deepest break, the panfish will be on the edge of the bottom. That's where the hard bottom meets the soft bottom, and that's where all your, your insect life, your zooplankton, and your bloodworms. And these are just little squiggly things that make panfish big, and they're gonna be cruising and grazing. And sometimes, for my third tip here is, remember, sometimes they bite in the morning, sometimes they bite in the evening. On, on darker waters, they'll bite all day. But clear bodies of water, if you're not catching them, don't give up because they might run in the evening. And what they're doing is gathering all these insect life as they come up in darker conditions. And then under thick ice and thick snow, the zooplankton and the bugs will come up even under the ice, even in the middle of winter, so you can catch panfish all day long. Interesting stuff. And it's all about the food and, and having it. Bro, I want to thank you for sharing this stuff with us. Thank you.